Hi there. Welcome back. I am back with another episode of Snowflake Concept Series that is about snowflake stages which are key part of data loading and unloading. But what exactly are they and how do they work? Let me simplify it for you. Stages in Snowflake are storage locations that act as temporary holding areas for data before loading into tables. But why? They enable efficient scalable data loading by allowing bulk inserts instead of row by row loading. They also help validate and transform data before committing to tables. This make the process faster, more flexible and reliable. Two types of stages are in use: internal stages and external stages. An internal stage is created and managed by Snowflake and is not directly accessible to the user. Even though you can't directly browse the storage location, you can interact with an internal storage using Snowflake SQL commands to check the files stored, to upload the files and to query data from an internal stage. Again, there are three types of internal stages. Table stage which automatically available for each table data is stored temporarily here next one is user stage each user has a private stage last named stage created explicitly using create stage external stages in the external stage area we store our raw files in the blob storage provided by microsoft azure aws s3 or google cloud storage in order to make a secure connection between the external staging area and the snowflake we use the integration object in the internal stage area the process will remain almost the same the only difference will be that the integration object will not be required this is because the staging area will be provided by snowflake and the stage object will be sufficient to provide the secure connection when to choose internal versus external stages in snowflake Internal stage is ideal for small to medium data sets and quick data loading and unloading. Use it when you don't need external cloud storage setup. On the other hand, external stage is ideal for large data sets and cross platform sharing. Use it when your data is already in cloud storage or you need multi system access. Here is how to use Snowflake stages. Quick summary on the key takeaways Snowflake stages are temporary storage locations used for efficient and scalable data transfer Stages enable bulk inserts data validation and transformation before loading into tables Two types of stages internal and external internal stage managed by Snowflake while external is residing in cloud storage External stages require integration objects for secure connections while internal stages allow direct access. Data loading involves put command for uploading files and copy into command for loading into tables. Data unloading involves copy into command for exporting data and get command for downloading files. Users can query stage data using SQL commands. Now you know how snowflake stages work. If this helped, drop a like and subscribe for more snowflake content. See you in the next one.